or books that you've grown out of, and I'll sell them and give the money to buy food for hungry mouselings. I've grown out of loads of things, Mrs. Thimble. Alice will help me sort them out. Mm. Won't you, Alice? Mm. Oh, uh, yes. isn't it? Um, huh, afraid so. Right then, go. Um, uh -huh. Hey, that's Polka. I haven't seen Polka for ages. I was really fond of her. We used to dance together before I was old enough to go to Miss Lily's. Where did you get her? Can't remember. Anyway, definitely babyish. Bye, Polka. But I look so silly there. Nonsense, dear. You look sweet. Oh, look, it's you and Polka. Oh, yes. Oh, I remember the day I won Polka for you at the fair. Hmm? Yeah, yeah. And you promised me that you'd never ever let her go. I did? Yes. How is she, my dear? Um, uh, uh, fine. She's, she's fine. And I remember why you called her Polka. It was because you and Grandpa used to dance the Polka together. And I used to play for you. It was our special dance. May I? Oh, uh, um, I'm ever so sorry. I'd love to dance, but I, I um, well, I, I forgot to tell Alice something. See you later. Bye. Oh. Angelina? Uh, Alice, come in. Alice, oh. I've made a terrible mistake. Oh. I need your help. Come quickly. We've got to get Polka back. Oh. Well, she's definitely not here. No. Oh well, can you remember who bought her? Let me see. Well, soon after you brought me your toys, someone came in and bought everything in the basket. And these have all come in since. <gasps> but who was it, Mrs. Thimble? Um, I'm sorry, dear. I've been so busy. I just can't remember. Oh, dear. We'll never find Polka now. But we've got to. Oh, I'm sure there's a way. <clears throat> there. <sighs> Lost. 
A furry, cuddly rag doll. If you see it, please tell Angelina at once. Do you think that's enough? <laughs> well, it should be. <laughs> heard anything. Oh, we've done all we can, Angelina. We can hardly go knocking on every door in the village. Oh! Hello? Um, did you buy any toys from Mrs. Thimble? No, no, I'm afraid not. Excuse me, have you ever seen a doll like this? Oh, hello. Uh, did you buy any toys from Mrs. Thimble? Um, wait a minute. Oh, oh, maybe. Oh, please, please. Is it this one? Oh, oh, no, no. And, um, oh, have you seen a doll like this? Hmm. Why don't you try Miss Twitch it across the road? Oh, come on, Alice! Oh, right. Uh, thanks. You're quite right, my dear. I did buy a lot of used toys from Mrs. Thimble. Oh! I packed them all up very, very carefully in lots of paper so that they would be safe and comfortable. I do love wrapping things up, don't you, dear? Oh, yes. <laughs> and then I sent them all off to the poor little orphans in Dacovia. Oh, no! Dacovia? <sighs> but that's thousands of miles away. <sighs> now what am I going to do? <laughs> uh <-huh. sighs> to be honest, Angelina, I don't think there's anything you can do. At least you've got tomorrow to look forward to. Tomorrow? You're helping Miss Lily with the beginners, remember? Oh, yes. Suppose I am. Now, sit down, everyone, please. <laughs> oh. Oh. Come in. There you go. Come in, Mary, darling. We haven't started yet. Goodbye, darling. Oh. Come with me. That's right. Now, come and sit down. Yes. Just sit there. Darlings? Yes? No. Shh, 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 shh. No. Now, sit up. Sit up. Straight backs, please. Please. Head up, darlings. Head up. Come along. Come along. Skip and skip and skip and skip and skip and skip and relax. Oh, very good, very good. Darling, would you like to join in now? No? Oh, that's all right, darling. Whenever you feel ready. Well done, everybody. Angelina, see what you can do. Now, watch me, please. I like your doll. Does she have a name? Did someone give her to you? Who was that then? Miss Twitchit. You're not from Dacovia, are you? I helped her wrap the toys up, and she let me choose one. I like this the best. Well, actually, she's... She's lovely. She likes dancing. Did you know that? Can I show you?
Goodbye. 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 You dance beautifully, Angelina. I'd like to dance like you. Thank you, Mary. I'm sure you will one day. I've got a name for her now. Have you? Yes. I'm going to call her Angelina. Oh. Is that all right? Yes. I'd really like that. <laughs> I loved Polka, and I'm really sorry for breaking my promise, Grandpa. Well, I'm proud of you. What? That was a very grown-up thing to do, Angelina. Polka's gone to someone who really needs her. Mary will love her and look after her, won't she? Yes. Oh. oh. <laughs> yes, she will. Um, may I have the honour of this dance? Why, yes, kind sir. <laughs> Caitlin's showing Anastasia how to do tondus. That means pointing your toes. Iman reminds me of Mary Grafer. It's very scary when you first start ballet, because everyone else is so big and they seem to know how to do everything. Oh, good! Anastasia's going to teach Iman how to point. Oh dear, I think Iman's still feeling too shy. Caitlin's making a magic pond with the blue scarf, just like the one Miss Lily uses to teach very little mouselings how to point. It's really fun. You have to dip your toes in and out of the water by pointing your feet. What are those heart shapes for? Caitlin's using them to teach Iman and Anastasia how to do first position. Iman's doing really well, but she'll need to put her teddy down if she wants to dance properly. That's a good idea. Caitlin's showing Anastasia how to fly on a magic carpet. I used to love doing that. First you kneel on it. And then jump up and pretend you're flying. Looks like Iman wants to have a go. Well done, Iman! Oh, look! Iman's doing a dance with the others now. It's such fun learning to dance, especially when one of the bigger children helps you.